Hello ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and everyone in betwixt, I'm Vince, also known as Pleasant Kenobi on the internet. I'm the Magic the Gathering content creator and of diarrhea so bad, your arsehole will never be clean again. Today I'm bringing you Big Bad Daddy Dom, not a deck name that I came up with, but it's actually one of my uh, splicers, one of my higher tier patrons called Titan Reaver. This deck is a Hell Carver Demon deck. This is a combo deck where we're going to make Hell Carver Demon. How we're going to do that is put it in the graveyard, bring him back, slap our opponent, exile everything and kind of like kind of doomsday ish without mana concerns and then we're going to try and cast seize the day we're going to try and cast savage beating or fury of the horde or even just an emrakul to take another turn hit them one more time i'll take another combat step and hit them one more time to then go again spin that wheel find some extra combat slaps then slap them for the extra combat slaps and basically that's the deck that's it the deck is using uh, shallow grave and corpse dance instead of the traditional reanimation spells of legacy simply because we want to give hell carver demon haste and hit them as fast as possible it's a fast combo deck now look i haven't had time to test this so i think the games are going to go a lot worse than uh what they would do if i kind of knew what i was doing but look hell carver demon is metal with a name like Hell Carver Demon, I challenge you in the comment section below to tell me another card in all of magic that is as metal sounding as Hell Carver Demon. Look at it. Look at him. Actually, when you look at him, he doesn't look that metal. He looks kind of sensual. And I, I think I didn't really understand why we we're saying Big Daddy Dom or not Big Daddy Demon. But now I've looked closely at the art for Hell Carver Demon, I completely understand why. I'm playing this because I allow all my splices, the higher tier patrons, to submit decks to a list, and now and again we pull from that list. Sometimes we're finding them in calls, maybe we should have refined this. There's only two copies of Entomb, which seems fucking mad, but who knows? And then I play them on the channel in streams or in videos. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you subscribe to the channel, drop a comment down below, let me know, well, what card has a more metal name than Hellcarver Demon. And without further ado, let's play some Legacy. Okay, this hand has no way to reanimate the Hellcarver, I would have to play Faithful Swing off of a Petal, which means we'd have no mana. I think I have some elegant this. Okay, this time around we have two lands, an Entomb, a Shallow Grave, a Hellcarver Demons. We can even Entomb for the looting to try and get there. I'm going to give this a shot. I'm going to go ahead and put Hellcarver on the bottom of my library. We just need to find a way to put Hell Carver Demon in our graveyard. Ideally by drawing Faithless Looting or Burning Inquiry and getting lucky. Tropical Island from our opponent. This better not be... Fuck! We just played against in fact. What the fuck? Okay, we've lost the die roll and we're on the old... Uh, <laughs> the old four Chromox opening hand. Looks like they might be in fact... Or maybe some form of bug maverick. Either way, if they're maverick, we aren't facing days. If they're in fact, we're facing days. And I'd rather not face days. They think long and hard on this burning inquiry. Are they going to daze the burning inquiry? Let's find out. Is it burning inquiry or inquiry? Is that even a debate? There we go. If they daze the inquiry, though, that means that we aren't getting our corpse dance dazed, perhaps. The tropical island we know about. A green mana for a glistener elf. <laughs> Days plus glistener elf. I mean, it's, it's, it's I'm not 99% sure we're against infect. Ah, oh, the second glistener elf. That tells me we're definitely playing against infect. So we might just be dead here. We have a black mana up, so they might have to respect us having a push or similar. They attack the glistener elf for two with the exalted. The fact that they didn't attack with both of them tells me that we're just dead because they've got enough to kill us with one of them. Attacking with both is better against removal, right? So yeah, they, they had they had the days to stop us, the invigorate and the berserk. So yeah, we're, we're dead. Okay. Must be nice. <laughs> oh, fuck my life. Okay, it's fine. We're going to just like top deck the win now, right? Oh, no, we didn't do it. We're fucking dead. We can play a... We can play a simming spirit guy to block with, but I'd rather shit in my own mouth, honestly. We return you now to your regularly scheduled program. Seems fun. I'm really glad that's what we paired up against. I guess I don't want to get wastelanded here, so I'm going to go for a swamp. I'm going to entomb the Hellcarver Demon in their end step, and then I'm going to shallow grave the, in the Hellcarver Demon in, in our turn, and hopefully that's enough. If they just randomly kill us here with Berserk, then... We were never meant to win. We can also play, pay for days with Spirit Guide here as well. Okay. They got us for one Infect. They play a Library. I'm going to cast in Tomb here for one Black Mana. 
they daze us. We've got the spirit guide, which is pretty sweet. Maybe our hammer's better than I realize. Uh, we're gonna grab another Hellcarver demon. Maybe Grizzle Bomb was the correct one. Who who knows? I don't know. Badlands, black and red. Let's go ahead and shallow grave a Hellcarver demon. Oh yes. <laughs> oh yes. Come on, can we get there? We're gonna attack with this. We hit them for six. We trigger Hellcarver demon. What do we get? Okay, we sack these. Sure, sure. That was that was anticlimactic. We get these. What do we get? What do we get? What do we get? What do we get? We're gonna cast. Oh, holy sweet fucking Jesus! We're gonna cast Emrakul. <laughs> okay. Uh, I should have cast the extra combat step there as well, but I didn't. Okay. Well, I I thought I thought the okay was for the trigger of the Emrakul, but the okay was for the for the whole thing. So I should have put Emrakul on the stack, then I should have part cast uh the. I don't know, Bunning and Crew for fun, and then I should have seen if Shadow Grave got us back a Grizzle Brand at that point, then I should have took the extra combat step, but it doesn't matter! Because Hellcover Demon into Emrakul got us there. Right, now they're gonna fuck us up. They're gonna really fuck us up. They're gonna have, like, Tom Watts Crypts and all sorts of shit. So, I'm gonna bring in Thought Seas to disrupt their combo and reanimate so we can reanimate stuff as well. Um, I'm gonna cut some of the top end. Not the Emrakul, because that's an extra turn spell that we can get off of the Hellcarver. I'm gonna cut both Grizzle Brands. I'm gonna cut like two C cut one corpse dance because reanimate is kinda like corpse dance, but they don't have removal spells, just reanimating things is better. Also our life total doesn't cut a simian, cut an inquiry. Okay, here we go. Okay. If we had a hell cover in hand, we could actually like dark ritual forces the hell cover shadow grave it on turn one, but we don't. So I guess I'm gonna have to mulligan this. <laughs> Not good. Okay, I guess we give this a sh put Savage Beat on the bottom of our library and put one of our Shallow Graves. We might just be fucked, firstly. They, they've kept a seven. We're gonna have to either Simeon out our Faithless or Petal out our Faithless. Uh, I'm unsure. I guess if we Simeon the Faithless looting and they don't daze, we can then like Shallow Grave. So maybe we've got a kill here. This hand is probably one of the best fives we could ask for. Although if they have daze or Force of Will, we're probably just fucked. Daze. We can kind of play through a little bit. Oh my god, we drew that thing. Swamp, cast Faithless. Oh my god. Please let it happen, please let it happen. We can wait a turn. Do we wait a turn? Do we wait a turn? Do we wait a turn? Discard. Discard. I need to make sure that... That doesn't matter. It'll be the only creature in the graveyard. Do we wait a turn? I'm going to Thought Seize them, and next turn we're going to Shadow Grave them. So, they have Rest in Peace, Veil of Summer, Noble Hierarch, Invigorate, Listener, Blighted. Okay, well, get rid of Rest in Peace, just in case they draw a white sword. Next turn we're going to Shadow Grave them, my friends, and then when we finish Shadow Graving them, we're going to kill them, Hope hopefully. So they go Glister Elf, sure. They drew that Misty, so we know they have no interaction. I am actually genuinely really fucking excited right now. Let's go, Shallow Grave. Come to daddy. Okay. We're then going to slap him with Hellcarver Demon. Oh, this feels good. We're going to hit him. We're going to trigger. I'm not going to mess up the trigger this time. We're going to say... So this gives us an extra combat step, right? So we're going to go... Cast... Do we even want to cast a Crumlux? <laughs> We're going to cast this anyway. Storm Count. Cast this, targeting them. Cast this. Untap this. Cast this, I guess. It gets it out of our deck. It's already exiled, Vince. What the fuck are you talking about? We get a Chromox. which will just be a random artifact at this point. Okay. Sure, whatever. We can tap it for nothing, I think. Tap it for nothing. Untap Hellcarver and get another combat step after this one. Thought sees them. They're gonna crack their Misty Rainforest and cast a Brainstorm? No, they're gonna cast a Veil of Summer. Oopsie daisy. They don't get to draw a card though on the ups. Then we're gonna go, okay, lose that black mana. Go. Okay, so we're in main phase. Go to combat again. Wait, 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 what? Oh, fuck, Vince! You skipped the combat step? Oh my god! What the fuck? <laughs> they don't get to draw a card, though, on the upside. We make three black. 
Then we're going to go, okay, lose that black mana. Go to combat. Okay, so in main phase, go to combat again. Wait. Wait, 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 what? Oh, it hurts. Oh, right inside the pit of my stomach, it hurts. I think I fucked up, kids. Big Daddy PK fucked up. Okay, well, I guess I'll just click okay. I... Oh, fuck. I thought I had... Oh, bollocks. It's fine, it's fine. The, the, the stars will simply align once more, right? <laughs> oh my god! Magic is hard. Okay, in in my defense, I don't think I've ever cast Seize the Day before. I have cast Fury of the Horde, but never Seize the Day. I would love to. What are we looking at? We can go Burning Inquiry, no way to reanimate. Okay, next opening hand. We have Dark Ritual, Hellcarver, Simeon. This does mess up their hand. We'll give it a shot. Oh, we would have had a win. My friends, we would have had a win. Okay, let's go Badlands. Let's go Exile Swing Spirit Guy. Burning Inquiry. Force of Will. Okay. Well, that's one piece of permission out of the way. Now we just need to draw both Faithless Looting in we need to draw Faithless Looting into Shallow Grave. Fuck me, I'm sorry, my friends. You came here to see Hellcarver Demons. We've we've hit them twice. The first time I fucked it up, the second time I fucked it up. Fucking it up is easy when you're playing a new combo on Modo. Bear in mind, I wanted to practice some games with this in the 1v1 queues or the, the practice queues, but in the morning in my time zone, no one was playing. One person was in the practice rooms, but they were just AFK. So I loaded into the game, said hello, and just sat there for five minutes. That's my excuse, so I'm sticking to it. Okay. Simeon Spirit Guide. Pass the turn. Fuck. We need to draw, like... Faithless into Shadow Grave is the nut draw. Burning Inquiry into F F F uh, Shadow Grave is also a nut draw. Let's seize the day. No. Fuck, are we just gonna die? We should have won that last. Oh, I say, that said, we weren't we didn't have the win on board. We we're gonna untap our health carbon, hit them again, and try to find another extra turn or extra extra uh, combat step, uh, 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 spell. Take two infect. Invigorate. Take six infect. Yep, sure thing, buddy. Draw a swamp? Nope. Okay. Well, if they have a pump spell, we're dead. Like, every pump spell on their deck uh, gets plus two, plus two as a minimum, right? Whether it be Invigorate, Croton Strength, whatever the fuck it's called. The one with the Kicker. Vines of Old Croser? Vines of Vastwood? I don't know. Magic card names, they're all the same. They're all the same. If we don't die, what that means is that they have permission. Okay, we're dead. Fuck. I hope you enjoyed me fucking things up real bad uh thanks for watching in the end we went zero five because well because days is a magic card and also the deck doesn't feel consistent enough like i drew 20 plus cards in multiple games and never saw the ability to actually shallow grave or corpse dance uh in spite of drawing a third of my deck i wonder if playing four in tombs is the correct way to go um and maybe even actually just relying on reanimate to put hellcarver demon to play considering hellcarver demon isn't legendary so that makes it basically strictly better than grizzle brand right let me know what you think in the comment section below. I've been Vince, also pleasant coming on the internet. Until next time, be good to one another. Don't shit in your hands and clap. And I'll speak to you all very, very soon. To Tarfana.